Hi everybody, welcome back to the Soapy Cauldron. If you're new here, my name is Jennifer and I make Harry Potter inspired soap. Tonight I'm making a soap that is inspired by Harry's broom, the Nimbus 2000, or when he upgraded to the Firebolt. Either one, you can take your pick of what it's playing off. It's going to be the color of wood, and I am hoping that I'm going to be able to stamp it with a, um, a soap stamp that I have. It's like a wood grain, hopefully. That's the goal anyways. So hopefully by the time it's all said and done, it'll be brown, and it'll look like a piece of wood, and it's also going to smell really good too. So if you'd like to see how I make this broom-inspired soap, then don't stop watching. Okie doke, let's make some soap. We have to start with lye water, and we're gonna pour it into our oils, like so. And then we are going to take a stick blender and stir it up. You can do this by hand if you want to. It just takes a really long time. So we speed things up with a stick blender. This is going to be a rather boring video because there's going to be not much to this soap. I have a plain bowl of soap. I'm going to add my fragrance oil, which is a blend of crisp juniper and cedar balsam. Well, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Somebody's, of course, probably going to let me know. Um, and then I'm using Bronze Brown by Nurture Soap to color this soap. It's like a coppery brown because wood is usually brown. But we're not going to put a ton of brown in there because I don't want it to be ridiculously dark. We're just going to put about, mm, let's do a little bit more. I don't ever measure things and just kind of say, yeah, that looks good. All right, we're going to do that much and see what that gives us. With my Ravenclaw spatula, I'm going to scrape off my stick blender to try and get all of this soap that I possibly can. And then I'm going to pour it in the mold. And then I have to make a mess, right? Can't. I cannot seem to do a video without making a mess. All right, let me get my mold and we'll pour this in there. Okay, trying so hard not to spill. We made it. I really like this color and I think the stamp is gonna look really nice if I can make it work. I think the goal is going to be when I cut the soap to make sure to stamp it fairly quickly while it's still soft. Let's scrape out our bowl. And then guess what, guys? <laughs> That's it. Told you the soap was gonna be really quick and easy. Okay, we're gonna come back in 18, 24 hours to me, but three seconds to you, and cut the soap. Okie doke, let's cut soap. It's gonna be plain brown, obviously, but we're gonna try the stamp out. And then I also have another idea, if the stamp doesn't work, uh, to see if we can make it look like a piece of wood. So, plain brown soap. We are going to keep cutting and cutting. But then we're going to attempt to stamp it with the stamp or my other thought is I found this like straw cleaner, I think it is, right here, pipe cleaner, straw cleaner. And I think if I scratch that down the surface of the soap, it'll look like wood. But we're going to try the stamp first because that is why I bought the stamp. So we're going to keep cutting, but I am going to cut to stamping. We're going to take this stamp. It's supposed to look like a wood grain, and hopefully since the soap is really soft, I can stamp this pattern onto the soap. 
I don't know if this will work at all, but that's the goal. stuck let's see oh gosh this might have been a mistake <laughs> I can't get it off oh no uh can you see the wood grain there we go looks like wood grain kinda to me I'm gonna see if on the other side I can do it again but press even harder I need to stand up for this. Okay. Let's see if that did anything. It's really on there. Yep. It looks like wood. Like it. Okay, let's do that again and again and again and again. Lots and lots and lots of times. Let's see. Okay, before I move on, I'm going to take this pipe cleaner. I'm going to take the pipe cleaner and I'm going to see what this looks like. It looks like wood too though, guys. What do y'all think? This is a sample piece, so it doesn't really matter if I mess it up. Kind of like this. It gives it a... Yeah, I think I'm gonna go, maybe, let's see. I don't know. I like the stamp too though. I think we'll go with the stamp. I like the stamp. All right. Thanks for watching.